FNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we got a mixed bag out here. That mix coming from the Dow and the S&P, which are off 87 and 8 points, respectively. NASDAQ 100 is up 8. Russell's off 5. Semis are up 10. We got a mixed bag out here. Gold's off 60 cents. Silver is flat. Lights recruit up 86 pennies. Natural gas up 15 cents. She's trading out at 708, and the 30 year Treasury trading at 126.07. That's back 18.30 seconds. As we take a look at our nine panel, Market update chart, we'll see that the ES Mini again for three sessions in a row, struggling to take out the top of its daily profile. That's at the 3807 level out there. That's the area to watch. Close above that, we then suggest to move up to the 3898 area. But if you can't bust some of the upside, uh, price may try to bust them to the downside. Support for the ES Mini is between 3645 and 3677. If you take last spot volatility, still well above its 50 day exponential moving average. The 50 days at 2671. The spot is trading out at 2917. As long as the spot volatility remains above that, it's going to be a very choppy market or a market that uh, wants to move lower. If you take a look at the NQ out there, and both the all you know the ES, the NQ, the Russell, the Dow, they all have bottoming patterns out there by the D point patterns. In the case of the NQ, just consolidating with inside its daily profile, its resistance level eleven eight forty one. If you take a look at the U.S. dollar index, uh, talking about hitting resistance, the top of its daily profile, which is at the one eleven ninety one area out there, close above that would suggest a run for the hills. No, it's recent highs. If we take a look at Goldilocks out there, what you don't see. The question should be, hey, Steve-O, price is above its daily profile. Price is above the center of its weekly profile. How come it's not moving up to 1779? And during the Trader's Edge show, we'll go take a look at that weekly chart, which shows the oscillator and change line, which is red. And that's where price is finding resistance. And that's going to be an important message come tomorrow. Silver, it is trading above the top of its weekly profile. It is trading above the top of a new daily profile that is attempting to form. But yesterday was a sell the deep point pattern, a bearish engulfing candle. That suggests that silver wants to pull back. Lights we crude should go target the top of its weekly profile. And that's up at the 90.65 level. Natural gas has a nice buy the deep point pattern. Price inside that bullish structured profile, it should now target the top of that profile where the sellers reside. That's at $7.37 in a 30-year treasury, trying to hold support. That's the bottom of its daily profile at 126.04. Folks, if you're off to start your Thursday, please have a terrific one. If not, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. We'll be back in just a few moments.